Please do not attempt anything we do on this channel. We are trained professionals. What's going on guys? It's Anderson the Double Cheeseburger and today we're going to be reviewing Mickey's Malt Liquor. <clears throat> Mickey's Fine Malt Liquor to be exact. Yummy! 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 So we've had this many times on the channel, uh, I've had it many times in my life, I've said it before, it's my favorite malt liquor, and uh, I think it still holds true. Second to this, I would say Colt 45 is next best, but yeah, today we're just going to do a quick little review. I just got a two pack, they're two for six. Also a great deal, can't go wrong with that. Yeah, so let's get into it. <clears throat> they're 5.6% ABV, so a little bit on the lighter side when it comes to malt liquor. OE and stuff is like, uh, I think OE is 7% out here or 8, I can't even remember. But yeah, most malt liquors are up there. Hurricane stuff like that But yeah, this is a Mickey's fine malt liquor review Let's get into it. Yummy <sighs> Yeah that's a classic Mickey's right there. If you guys haven't had one yet, which most of our community has, go out and try it. <clears throat> it's not like, trust me, like I've had bad nights with other malt liquors, as I'm sure most drinkers have. Mickey's you can't go wrong with. Um, it was the one I would prefer most when I would do like 800 clubs. I did it with the 1200 club with the Mickey's, so that was a big deal to me. <clears throat> But yeah, that's why I stick to it. It's easy as it goes down. Tastes the best in my opinion. And it gives pretty clean burps. <clears throat> These are kind of room temp now though. I left them out too long while I was setting up the camera. Still tasty though. Yummy. And I wish I was better at reviewing stuff. <clears throat> um, like, I don't really know what to say about <clears throat> what kind of after notes it has and stuff like that, but I don't know. I guess it just tastes like a standard beer to me. Like, I feel like if you're a kid and you never drink, if you never drink in beer, but you've just smelt it or something, and that smell is probably like what this would taste like. <clears throat> By the way, uh, I want to shout out all you guys, everyone that's been supporting us, you know, super duper, gave us a shout out, uh, challenge accepted, had us on this podcast, and uh, as you guys know, if you're barely coming back to the channel, or if you've been back, you know we got deleted, so uh, we're trying to build back up from scratch, no more challenges, <coughs> just uh, mostly beer reviews for now, seltzer reviews. Uh, food reviews are coming up. We got some food challenges we're gonna do <clears throat> But yeah, thanks all you guys for supporting and sticking with us through these times as um, Smoke in a small town says and times of darkness we stay lit. I like that Cheers to everyone out there By the way, <coughs> on our second channel, 
slurred speech. <coughs> we have a podcast going. So if you guys want to check that out. I put them at the end screen. I always drop one of our uh, podcasts up. So that's the video version on YouTube. And we're also on all audio platforms. Spotify, Apple, uh, Pocket Cast, all that stuff. So if you guys want to go check it out, have a laugh. <clears throat> Long form conversation with me and the Faded Fam. Me and Megaho are the co-hosts, so that's always a blast. And uh, we're bringing the Faded Fam on one at a time. And eventually we'll bring more people on as CA and Super and people like that. So go check that out if you haven't yet. <clears throat> I'm sure you guys will get a laugh. Hopefully we laugh the whole time pretty much. But yeah, Slurred Speech Podcast. <coughs> if you look it up on audio versions, you'll see uh, me and Mega Hill pop up. <coughs> I wish I would have chilled these a bit more. No beer is good warm, but I would say malt liquor specifically is the worst warm. I could handle a room temp Modelo, but a room temp a malt liquor of any kind, not really a good choice. They also have uh, <coughs> Mickey's and little uh, 12 ounce bottles, <coughs> the hand grenades, <sighs> man those are sick too, <coughs> they, uh, they all have little riddles under the caps, I'm sure most of you guys know about that if you haven't though, <coughs> grab a little six pack, <coughs> that's a good buzz right there, and you just try to solve the riddles. Most of them are pretty easy, but they do have some difficult ones that I can't get. One or two, I, I think I've gone most of them, but some of them I didn't get. Sugars. On to number two. <clears throat> I'm not going to lie, I spit up a mouthful of, uh, you know, foam and whatnot. Like I said, it's been a while since I've had a 40. I'd say since last December. So, since the channel got terminated, <clears throat> but yeah, they're still good to me. Like I said, I think I let it get too warm. Um, yeah, no excuses though. I need to stop being a little weenie and man up. <clears throat> yeah, here's on number two. Like I said, two for six on my local gas station. Great deal. Can't go wrong with that. Catch a nice buzz off both of them. Get a little yummy up. Man, this just reminds me of the old days of the Faded Fam. <clears throat> They're very nostalgic. Um, I would say Cole 45 though, like I said, is my second favorite. I just can't, I mean, they don't carry them as often out here. They do, but in tall cans, and no one wants to drink a 40 out of a tall, I mean a malt liquor out of a tall can. At least in my opinion, I don't. I feel like that looks even bummier. It feels bummier. No offense to people that drink tall cans of malt liquor, but if I'm already drinking malt liquor, I want it to be in the 40 or at least the grenades. Well, oh, by the way, today's Friday, 40 Friday. <laughs> nah, it's not really. By the time I upload this, it'll be Saturday, so don't oh, down. I would definitely say the <clears throat> next time I do a video with Mickey's or any type of malt liquor, I need to chill it a lot more. This is warm right now. I'm not complaining, I'm just saying I messed up. <clears throat> also, this would have been even a little treat, I'd say. A nice crisp Mickey's on a Friday night. You can't go wrong. Yummy!
by the way, we're almost back to 500 subs again, so like I said, thanks a lot everyone. That's a great milestone. I remember how long that took us when we on the first channel. It's crazy that we were able to get there that quick again. Of course, we couldn't have done it without the chuggers, you know, and the chuggers in our community, so thanks again everyone. I feel like I'm gonna cross eyed right there. <laughs> uh, what, what's coming up? Like in that mouthful of foam that came up too? I mean, don't get me wrong, it was a big mouthful, but it was uh, Slim Jims, like, like beef jerky sticks. Ugh, not a good combo at all. Definitely didn't feel good. Tastes way better going in than coming out. Take one last little swig, and then I have a, a fan favorite of yours to bring out. I don't want to keep doing it and make it tacky, but out of high demand, popular demand, <coughs> you guys now have to bust out Henry. Whew. He just got tatted up too. Fifth member of the Fate of Family to get it tatted on him. Or fourth, I think. My bad. <sighs> Yummy. This is the best beard review tool you can have with you. Or should I call him a beard review buddy? Henry, you son of a bitch. But yeah, let's, uh, I would have uh, reviewed him with the full one. But nah, who am I kidding? I might, uh, my chugging games are out of whack, so. My chugging games, my chugging game. I'm getting a little yummy up. It's another thing, 40 to the face. That's a good little, good little yummy up session. Two 40s, two for six dollars. Like I said, that's a great night. What do you think, Chugger is about a third? That looks like a third. We'll give a third to our boy Henry here. He's thirsty. I did give him a bath, by the way, so that's a good thing. By the way, if you guys are interested in getting your own Henry, um, I got him at Spencer's Gifts. They're in most malls. I want to say... I don't know if Canada has them or not, but definitely in America, in the States, we got all, we got Spencer's in like every mall. <coughs> Damn, Henry, you son of a gun. <sighs> Henry just got blasted up, so he's feeling tough now. <sighs> but yeah, this is the best way to appreciate the beer, malt liquor, whatever you're reviewing. This is the best review tool you could have, I'm telling you. Um, <clears throat> it really helps me out, so. Let's finish reviewing this Mickey's Fine Malt Liquor. Number one, in my opinion. I want to say majority of the Fated Fam, too. I think uh, their favorite is Mickey's when it comes to malt liquors, but I'll have to take a survey on that and I'll, I'll ask everyone. But yeah, comment down below. Check out Slurry Speech, IG, it's just my name on Instagram, so Anderson the Double Cheeseburger. And uh, yeah, thanks again, Chuggers. We're back, baby. Shout out everyone that supported us, that stuck with us, and let's get back to where we were and beyond. Uh, let's go, Henry. There you go, Mickey's Fine Malt Liquor.
assisted by Henry.